Ah, uh, I don't think she's gonna work. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Right, guys we are on our way to spirit halloween and i just want to say before we get started do something nice for your mama today tell her you love her on their way out here i saw this stand they were selling these flowers <laughs> so i stopped by and grabbed some for my mom let's go see spirit halloween all right guys we are here we are in boardman ohio and i am so excited because not only are we going to a spirit halloween in this older vintage awesome toys r us store over here it's a party place, which we're also going to go check out, but that'll be a separate video. So make sure that you subscribe, hit that bell so you get notifications, and come back all the time. Mask is killing me. Look at that, guys. How epic is that? Oh my gosh, look. They still have the old sign up under the Spirit Halloween sign. That is a Toys R Us sign. Okay, so let's go in here, check this out. Look, maximum number of customers, 84. We're here early, so I don't think that's gonna be a problem. Thank you, automatic doors. Please use other entrance. Okay, here we go, guys. I'm excited. Yes. Oh, you gotta love Spirit Halloween, guys. Right in the door, it looks so awesome. The Reaper's Island. I gotta feel this. I gotta... Okay, it is fabric. I just wondered. I was curious. I think most of the setups are probably going to be pretty close to the same in these stores, but you never know. I mean, it depends on what's available. So let's start out with Crouchy here. Here he goes. Every Crouchy I have seen this year has had the most messed up hair. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, let's do the butcher. You gotta love his meat cleaver. Look at that. So cool. I wonder if you can like position his. Oh, what the heck? Oh, there. Okay, there's a wire or something in there. I think you can like position the hands because some of these I've seen have the meat cleaver in this hand. And some are in this hand holding it up like he's ready to chop your neck. Look at this, guys. Look who's peeking out from behind this pillar. It's the Huntress. I mistakenly called it a guy the other day. Forgive me. It's a chick. Give it a try. Uh, I don't think she's going to work. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> that literally scared the crap out of me, guys. Oh, my God. I had to, like, stomp on the pad to get it to work. <laughs> Best thing ever, guys. The Hauntress totally got me. I just might have to buy her just because that was so scary. I think I gotta change my pants. Look at this, guys. I am still shaking. <laughs> that was my favorite scare ever. Oh my god, I'm so glad I came out to this store. Oh, I'm gonna have a heart attack. All right, we gotta do that again. That was absolutely hilarious. Come on. There we go. You didn't get me that time. Buster. <laughs> Buster chick. All right. I got to catch my breath. That was... Oh, my gosh. Let's go through the fiery flames. Gotta love the fiery flames. And back through the fiery flames. I'm going to trip. Okay, yeah. I, I wanted to look and see if they had the flames on top there because a couple of the swords, I haven't noticed them. But, yeah, there they are on top. Look at that. That is such a cool picture right there. I love that so much, guys. <laughs> oh my god, I love Halloween. Okay, let's go over here and check out this guy. Punctured Pete, or as we like to call him, Impaled Andy. Oh wait, I forgot he doesn't actually have an activation pad. He's just supposed to be moving. I wonder why he's not. Hmm. Yeah, that's a bummer that he's not moving, but he's pretty cool anyways. Look at his face. Check out his face, guys. That is creepy. Look at that. That kind of looks like Freddy Krueger from the remake, which I didn't like. All right, I'm curious about the mechanism on the Hauntress. Yeah, they got a brick there to hold it down. That's what I was wondering, because when it comes out... To this side, it thrusts out over there. 
And when I was watching online, I always wondered, like, what keeps it from just falling over? But, yeah, they got a brick down there, so I guess that's what you'd have to do. Oh my gosh, guys. My heart is still pounding from that stupid Hauntress. That was so scary. All right, let's get Dahlia going here. Stay away! Here we go. Spooky! Man, they got a lot of awesome stuff, guys. I can't wait to dig into all this stuff, but let's check out the other animatronics here. Ooh. Hmm. Fright in the box isn't looking too good. For some reason, this falls off of a lot of them. Let's see if he works, though. Ooh, there's the eyes. Okay. It's turning. I don't hear any music. Then he jumped up. Okay, that, I mean, it was kind of lackluster, but whatever. Okay, I repaired him there. The lid is supposed to be on. It's supposed to pop up when he comes out, so let's see if it works. Hmm. Okay, there he goes. Still don't hear any music, but let's see if he pops out. Eh, he tried. Okay, well, that's kind of a bummer, but... Sorry, Mr. Clown with the yellow eyes. Well, I guess that's what it is. All right, we got Pennywise and we got Sam. Let's do Sam here. There you go. I like how his sucker is kind of spinning. Thank you, Mr. Button Eyes. The music reminds me of Children of the Corn. Let's do Pennywise here. Oh, he didn't jump up. What the heck, man? I mean, he's cool looking, but he didn't jump up the way he's supposed to. He's supposed to jump up about a foot or two. Remember, I gave one of these away last year, guys. Oh, the feud continues. Johnny Punk. How could you come to my neck of the woods? Wait, this isn't my neck of the woods. I'll give you a three-second head start to get lost. One, two, three! Okay. I think I may actually be able to like him if he had a better movement. I mean, at least if he had a better movement and he could move on the swing, I would like him a little bit better. I've been waiting for you to come out and play. Well, I've been waiting for you too, Johnny Punk. And you know what else, Johnny? What are those? Wait, what am I talking about? What are those? All right, Johnny, till next time. Jack Straw, a.k.a. Cactus Jack, a.k.a. Jack Sparrow. <laughs> that was pretty creepy. As many times as I've seen him, he still is a good scare. You gotta love Jack Straw. Okay, it doesn't look like this spider is set up. Wait a minute. Where's the string going? Hmm, okay, that's weird. But this one, well, I think is. Yep. Ah, they're, okay, I see. Yeah, they were both hooked up to this one pad. So this wiring goes up and over and down to that guy, and then they both attack at the same time. Let's try it again. All right, here we go. Yeah, that was cool. That was a really good effect. And they jump really quick, too. So if you were just simply walking through and you didn't know, you'd get spider bit. All right, guys, here we go. Peekaboo Clown and Charlie Bucket. I got a golden ticket. All right, here we go, Charlie. Charlie? There we go. Want a little candy? Come on. I won't hurt you much. <laughs> Looks like Charlie got in a little tussle. <laughs> Good old Charlie Bucket got in a tussle at the chocolate factory. Fight with an everlasting gobstopper, did we? All right, peekaboo clown, here we go. Ooh, Halloween is so frightening. I can't bear to watch scary things. I'm such a sensitive soul. Blah! Perhaps you will come closer and keep away the boogeyman. <laughs> I think your breath's gonna keep me away aqua fresh. <laughs> <laughs>
He's really loud, guys. I love when they're really, really loud. Let's check him out again. I just love hide and seek. One, two, two and a half. Ready or not, here I come. Look at those <laughs> eyes. There's nowhere to hide on Halloween night. Oh, I just love that game, particularly with crying little babies. <laughs> I'm ready to play again. I love him. I just wish he jumped a little faster when he said boo. All right, guys, we're going to make our way over here where they have a bunch of awesome stuff set up. But first, look at this. They have a whole pile of sitting scarecrows here. A hundred dollars. Look, he was a hundred and sixty. Now he's a hundred bucks. Oh boy, am I tempted. Oh boy. Oh boy, am I tempted. <laughs> Here's our favorite spiders with a drop dead deal of $49.99. You gotta love the spiders, guys. I don't see. I don't see the brown one. Oh yeah, duh. I'm staring at the brown one. Oh my god, what an idiot. Wonder I get so scared by this stuff. I'm staring right at it and I don't even know. Man, look at this, guys. They got a lot of stuff in this store. Alright, let's check this stuff out. Holy crap, I got little Daisy and the Maestro. Sweet. The Butcher, Miserable Marie, Miss Mercy. They got a hugs. Holy crap. I am so tempted to buy hugs. Look how scary. Hello, hugs. <laughs> but look, they even have Ellie Hatchet. How awesome. You'd have to add something else to that, though. Like... I don't know, one of those dummies have it tied up and bent over a basket with some other heads in the basket and she chops the heads off. Wait a minute, what? $89.99 for jumping spiders? Weren't they just $49.99 on the other side? All right, we got a fright in the box here. We got mommy's favorite. Shh. We got a Bubba, you gotta love Bubba. Twisted Tina, what the heck? Her parents were high-flying contortionists, but after falling from a top rope in a daredevil act at 15, she was never quite the same. Okay, so she is just a prop, but she's fully posable, includes hanging bracket, and stands five feet tall. I don't know if I've ever seen her before. Look, we got Angeline, okay, and the Nightcrawler. This is one of my favorites. This one scared the crap out of me in one of the other stores, too. I think it was Copley. Look at how creepy that guy is. Oh my gosh, so scary. Oh look, they got a Pennywise too, how cool. They got a lot of stuff at this store, I love this. Yeah guys, here's the um, posable dummy prop I was talking about. You could take one of those, of course he has a head, but you could take him, lean him over a bucket, fill the bucket with these heads, and then put Ellie Hatchet over there, chopping the heads off. That would be cool. All right, guys, looks like we got the whole setup going on over here, but let's start on the end here. Angeline, I have not seen her in action Why yet. Why do you look so scared? Everyone in the graveyard just wants to be friends. <laughs> 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 that may have just made me love her. <laughs> do it again. I love the cemetery, especially at midnight, when it's colder and the other children are long asleep. Look at her legs going. I actually like this a lot better than I did online. Online, it looked really simple, but I actually love it, guys. Let's see if we can't get that laugh one more time. Do you want to play with me and all my friends? <laughs> come on, come on, play. Oh my gosh, that was great. Okay, we got Miserable Marie. Her jaw is moving a lot more than the other one I saw. I like it. I think that this would make a great addition to like a haunted yard or something or even a haunted house. Um, not my favorite, but she is cool. I love how you can hear her bones like crunching as she twists around. Miss Mercy. Listen to the bones crunching. <laughs> I was a nurse. I get it. I, I totally get it, Miss Mercy favorites, the sewer varmint. Look at the eyes. Two-headed freak. I love you, you two-headed freak. Did you have taken out of there? Maybe it got the Kim Kardashian butt implants. 
the harvester of souls. Look at me, just as all the others have. Now that I have you, your soul will be mine forever! I just cannot wait to see that guy set up with fog, man. So cool. I think he's my favorite prop this whole year. And I absolutely love the skull with the red eyes up there. Reminds me of the Goonies. I know I've said it before, and I'll probably say it again, like 25, 30, 40, 50 times this year. <laughs> we almost missed Mommy's favorite, guys, look. I gotta say, this is an awesome store. They have a lot of stuff set up. She's talking really quiet, so we'll go back to her in a minute when the music is off. But look at this, guys. They got even more stuff. Look at this. Creepy crimson girl on a swing. Swinging skeleton boy. Empty soul girl on a swing. All the swing props. Well, not all of them, but I mean, you know, a good handful there. And they have multiples. I don't think I've seen this one in any other store. Small, posable dummy prop. Oh, sweet, they got the inflatable Reaper and the Frankenstein. And then here's the other inflatables we're seeing in most of the other stores. The hands, the inflatable clown archway. Pumpkins, ghost, gargoyle, spooky tree. Okay, and here's all our zombie babies, guys. Somebody wanted me to point these out all individually, so let's take a look at them. We got this one that looks like he could be swinging on something. The one that's plotting your death when you go to sleep. Crawling zombie babies. Spider-eating zombie babies. Super evil crawling zombie baby. I don't know what this one's supposed to be doing, but it reminds me of, hey, oh, in the double-headed zombie baby, which I like to refer to as the cat dog. And I think that's it. I think that covers them all, guys. Those are pretty cool, though. I think I love the best, the, the, uh, the spider-eating zombie baby. Look at that. Oh my god, I hate spiders so much. If I saw this one coming at me, I would just kick it in the face. If I saw this one, I'd be like, no! Here's something else I gotta point out, guys. Somebody made fun of me the other day because I called this a brain. It's a brain. They said it's a heart. This is the heart. This is the heart. This is the mini brain. Okay, Austin Kirkham said, can you look for Halloween stuff and Leatherface? Um, there you go. <laughs> Texas Chainsaw Massacre, that is an awesome looking mask. It's not a full head mask, but it is made of real skin. Not really. All right, let's listen to her quick while there's some quiet music. All right, Lisa Pointer and a few other people asked me to go over weapons. Here's a whole bunch of weapons. Let's take a look at what they got. All of these are actually really awesome. Look, we got this dagger. We got a Viking axe, which is so cool. This big, uh, like, Grim Reaper scythe. I think that's how you say it. If not, I'm sure somebody will correct me. <laughs> Here's another kind of axe. Looks almost like a He-Man axe. Uh, let's see, what's that called? Executioner axe. Yes, chop off heads. Here's a switch scythe. That's cool, it flips out. Ooh, push the button and I think it goes bling! Here's a circular saw bat or something. Let's see what they call it. Saw blade weapon. That's pretty cool actually, I wouldn't want to get hit by that. This is just a baseball bat. Yep. Devilly pitchforks, couple of different kind of styles there. Kitchen knives, bloody knife, look at this one. Different kinds and styles of bats. Ooh, look at this one, this one has barbed wire on it. That's pretty cool. Worn cleaver, I like that, that's jagged. Look at this one. Ooh, uh, that's cool. There's another kind of dagger. A foam machete. Here's a rusty machete. Isn't really a weapon, but it's like a voodoo pole thing. Here's a sickle saw with a skeleton or something. That looks pretty creepy. That kind of reminds me of aliens. Here's a bunch of other sickles. More butcher knives. Almost like a Michael Myers thing. Looks like a Lamson Good now. That's actually the brand that he used. Oh, this is cool. A pipe weapon. Look at this. That's pretty sweet. Saw. A wrench. 
Uh, let's see, a sledgehammer, that's cool. Crowbar. Giant scissors for cutting heads off. Hammer. Uh, oh, hockey stick. That reminds me of uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Here's a jagged axe, I like the style of that one. That looks cool, wow, that's really soft too. I think there's some, yeah, here's like ninja swords over here. And then the ninja double sword thing you wear on your back. All right, I can't find the comment, so I'm sorry. I don't know what your name was, but somebody was asking me for a kid's size in the Plague Doctor costume. And there you go, there's the black one, and there's a brown one. Actually, now that I think about it, it may have been infant size that they were looking for. This is all their infant stuff here, and I do not see the Plague Doctor. Of course, this is only one store, so I'll keep looking. All right, guys, Godzilla 1964, as well as a bunch of other people, was asking me to find Five Nights at Freddy's. Here you go, a couple of them. We got Foxy and Freddy. I don't know a whole lot about this stuff, um, so I don't know how many different characters there are, but there's two of them at least. Look at this. I love this. I loved that movie Brightburn. I think they're supposed to be coming out with a sequel. This is a sweet costume, and I love that. All right, Raccoon X asked me to look for masquerade masks. Here's a whole bunch of them, actually. Pretty cool looking, and I don't know what all constitutes a masquerade mask, but they even have a couple over here. That's cool, the sugar skull mask. I like that. There's a leopard. Here's a cat, black cat. Uh, a couple of steampunk things here. Lace eye mask, fox eye mask, black flower, devil eye. This is cool, Deluxe Phantom Mask, sweet. Say you'll share with me one love, one lifetime. Raya Jellic wanted wigs and makeup to be Sally. Here we go. They even got a bow and press on nails. Sally gloves and tights. Elon wanted to see Harry Potter. Here you go. This is all adult stuff, but there's a bunch of costumes here. Hufflepuff, Gryffindor. They got the, um, whatever you call those things. <laughs> Cardigan. That's Slytherin. Oh, look at this, guys. Sweet. That's awesome. Ties. Bow ties. Patches. Bata glasses. Scarves. Hats. Magic wands. Whole ball of wax. The whole remember all of wax. Oh, somebody was asking about uh, minion stuff. There's a hat. There's goggles. Uh, suspenders. Tights. Here's costumes. Holy crap, these are the best ever, guys. I love them. I want them both. Oh my god, they even have Mermaid Man. <laughs> Alright, I do not see any Hugs dolls in here. I bought the one yesterday. I don't even remember where I was at yesterday. Oh my gosh. I did notice this sweet... Michael Myers statue here. Look at this. This is the coolest thing ever. Oh, holy crap, guys. He lights up. Look at this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is so cool. He's 40 bucks. That is so awesome, guys. Oh my gosh. The only thing that would make this better is if the pumpkin flickered. So cool. Okay, they also have an It statue. He's okay. That's not my favorite ever. I got Sam. Let's see if he lights up. Yep. Pretty cool. I don't know that I've seen these anywhere else either. Sam's lollipop string lights. That's cool. Oh, look, they got the Beetlejuice statue too. Here lies Beetlejuice. That is so awesome. Look at this. Carvacine pumpkin kit. It's skeletons in prison. All right, guys, I think we've been in here long enough. Let's go on to the next one. Stay tuned, and we'll find even more stuff that you guys are asking for. I'm out.